Hi, good night, everybody. Hey, how are you guys? Pretty good? Pretty good. Hello. Yeah, hello. I miss you. I thought nobody will come today. Why not? Well, I don't know. Maybe I was guessing. <laughs> oh, you, you might. You what? I thought everyone went to the stadium. The stadium for what? There is a soccer game tonight on the stadium. Really? Oh, I didn't know that. It's because I'm not too much fun of sports. Well, at least not no. soccer, you know. And I've been really busy, so I don't. I didn't have time to watch TV today. <laughs> to be honest with you. And who oh, plays I'm with who? El Salvador national team is going to play against Granada. Granada. That means uh, I mean Spain. It's from oh, it's an island, I think. Oh, it's the Caribbean. Caribbean, I think. Oh, the Caribbean. Oh, Caribbean. Yeah. oh my god! Know. But uh, and the stadium is full. No. No, of course not, right? It's a quarantine. Uh, yeah, but I think they they sold uh, some some of the. 30% of their capacity. Oh, the capacity. Oh, oh my goodness. Well, I didn't know that. Oh, well, hopefully everything's going to be all right. Hey, Carito, Carito, let me check. Okay. Okay, she said that she came late. She just came. She's having her dinner. Not lucky her. <laughs> hey, guys, how was your day? Was it good? A little bit. A little bit what happened, Amilcar. We missed you yesterday. What happened to you? Yeah, I know. Oh, come but on. these two days I was really tired. I know. I, was, I can't imagine yeah, it. Yeah. My my eyes was really, really tired and I I just want to sleep. <laughs> oh my god, this is a training, right? Yeah, I don't used to be in front of the computer all the whole day, but mm -hmm. it's really tired, but mm -hmm. I have to go to the uh the clinic to buy some glasses, I think. Really? Yeah, I will have to. Uh, Mr. Hernandez can let you know. Yeah, I know, guys, I know. Can you imagine? It's, it's not easy to be in front of the computer. No, it's really tired. Uh -huh. Can you imagine me being like that, like nine years? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ah, it's not easy at all, right? Yeah, I know, especially right now in, in because you, you got to work from home. So it's really hard, right? Yeah. <sighs> But you you're you will need to go to the doctor because you cannot see it. Uh because you you would like to or you need to buy glasses like protect from the from the computer screen. Yeah, protect it. Mm. My, protect my eyes because mm -hmm. uh at the end of the day I am really tired. Yes. But I want to go out. <laughs> yes, of course I yeah. know. You should like, way, uh, buy some, some dye drops. Yeah. I will have to buy it too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, tomorrow I have to go to the bank and I am going to buy something of that. Yeah, oh, you gotta have your first payment. Yay! No, ah, it's not oh, a payment. Ah, okay, okay, sorry for that. No, <laughs> my auntie sent me money and ah. I have to go for it. Ah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I, you know what? I thought, what, what, what's the what's the idiom that you use here in El Salvador, guys? When you first time you uh, you you work and you receive your first permit, there, there's an expression, right? Right, Alex or Paquito? I don't know. Maybe you know that. I I don't remember for the first. I don't I don't know for the first payment. Mm -hmm. when, La when culebra. The... Yeah, thank you. Oh. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, yeah, exactly. I never hear. Yeah, have, no, come on, you're Salvadorian. No way. <laughs> no, I just, I, I just know when they, when they say uh, payment and um, ya cayó la rata, pero it's the, the Oh usual. yeah, yeah. When, when you like, that is when, the you usual, wait, uh -huh. the usual when you receive yeah. it, the, you're waiting for the deposit, right? Yeah. But, but no, I, I didn't know the first for the first payment. <laughs> you didn't know that. Oh. Come on. Uh -huh. Hi everyone. Hi Luis. Uh, well, I and I knew it. Come on, you see, I'm more Salvadorian uh, than you are. How how is it? I'm sorry, I'm late. I would like to know what what is the expression you are talking about. How do you say in English? Ya cayó la rata. No, no. I was asking.
asking you guys. I was asking you how you say that in Spanish when uh, when you were expecting your money. <laughs> yeah, I asked you and Alex said that, right? But I was not asking exactly that. I was asking like when you had never had a job and finally you got your first job and you received uh, your first payment, right? So everybody's suspecting that you invite them. I don't know, like an ice cream or churritos or like a candy or something, right? So uh, I don't know who said that. Carito, I think. Carito said that is a, a culebrita. Is that true? Yes. That, that culebrita, right? Yeah, that's what they said. Yeah. <laughs> and Alex said, I haven't heard about that. Hey, but I think, hey, Irina, but that's true, right? Irina yes, and Paquito, right? Yes, okay. it's true. Uh, okay. The people is expecting because you invite them uh, for, um, well, and my job, they expecting to invite to eat some lunch or some dinner. Oh my goodness. No, yeah. no, no. Amilka, we're not going to ask too much, okay? Don't worry about it. We're not like that kind of guys, right? Who are like, no, 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 no. We're really nice friends. Yeah, you can invite us like an ice cream for each other and that would be amazing. That's all. Okay? Don't worry about that. <laughs> that was amazing. I thought it was that, Amilka, but, it, but it's nice, you know? It's really nice. We're talking about that he got tired, right? Of course. It's not easy. Imagine Alex is like this, like, <sighs> I know. No, but you know, I, I got uh, glasses, but I not get used to them. Really? You got glasses I, just to, to read or just to be in front of the computer for protect your eyes? Yeah, I have to use it, you know, but I cannot. Why use. not? As I went to a doctor and, and yeah. This is the last class of, of this module, right? Yes. Yes. So I, wear my I see fewer people than before. I don't know. Maybe they we gotta wait, right, guys? Yeah. <laughs> Thank oh. you, Luis. Yeah. So, so you're not used to it, Alex. Yeah. No. Oh. I, I, always, uh, I, I forgot. I forgot to to use it. You know. But you when, when I. Uh, if, I, if I'm working a lot, mm -hmm. like sure. yeah, mm -hmm. I'm sure I have to use it. Wow. Now. Yeah. But Irina is going to give you an advice. What's what you're about to say, Irina? Um, you should use because uh, you are going to get some damage of your eyes if you don't use it. Yeah, you listen. So. Um, listen to that. I got experience Wisdom. with that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because I I have some glasses and they are permanent, so I don't use them a lot of. So, but when I start to use them, the doctor told me that I have to use them all day. Uh huh. But I don't. I I, I almost I never use them, but <laughs> because that I don't see from. I mean. I don't see when someone is away from me. Like, ah, okay, okay. Like two meters, how do you say metros? How you say that in Met English? Meters. Meters, very yeah. good. Yeah, like people live are about one meter or a half, one and a half. So, and I don't use them anyway. <laughs> I don't okay, <laughs> at least he's uh, honest, right, guys? So what the, what is that? the name of the disease? It's like myopia or astigmatism? Where is Astigmatism. it? Astigmatism, Astigmatism. right? It, that, that is for somebody that for, for somebody who can can see from far away. From far away. All right. Yeah. All right. Ooh. The same. You had the same problem? That's yeah. <laughs> Oof. I'm lucky me. Yes. I do not use glasses at all. Yes, you are lucky, teacher. Yeah, I you know, have both both problems. In one eyes, I have one and one. Pia, uh, and the other one, I have a stigma. Can you imagine what kind of glasses you have? Oh my goodness! It's, and they're they're a, a little bit expensive, right? Yeah. Yeah, I can't imagine that. Oh my goodness! Why you have up to a D and other one up to? And, and you know, I, I renew like three times, but I I 
I can use it. <laughs> oh, come on. But when you, I, when oh. I, I come to use it, uh -huh. it's already not working. No. I oh. Mean, it works. Oh. I can see, I can see it well, but uh -huh. uh, I can see very clear and everything, but my... Your eyes. My, my, my view, yeah. Get tired, yeah. Oh, maybe you had to go to the, used to. to the optometrist I, and then try to evaluate yeah, it like, again. Right? I got to go again and I want to renew for a for, for, for Yeah, time, because you know? what, what happened, guys, is that your, um, I don't know, it could increase, right? Yeah. Yeah, it Definitely. could get worse. I know that. Oh, no, I'm, I'm It not. increases every time. Yeah. Mm hmm. You know what? I was a, a little baby girl who was sitting in front of the TV like this. And my yeah. mama said, come on, girl, get away from that TV. And I was like this. I don't know what, all the time. But I did not use glasses at all. And I'm almost 40. So I don't know why. Thank God. Mm -hmm. Thanks, God. <laughs> really? Yeah. So I do have like it's a perfect supposed, view. It, it's supposed after 40, uh, most of the women, uh, we have to use glasses. Don't tell yes. me that. Yes. <laughs> no. But you know what? I'm not 40 years old no yet. It's not That's true. why. It's, it's, not a, it's not a rule because I, uh -huh. I am uh, using glasses since I have 26. Mm. Yeah. So pretty young, actually. Almost close to Kirvin's age, right? Almost. Oh my goodness, really? But it depends right now. I think it's genetic, right? Because sometimes yeah, uh, we come from a, family. from parents yeah. or family who has a, like a eyes problems, something like that. So it depends on that. Yeah. But you know what? In my case, my both parents are supposed to use glasses. But I don't. It's really nice. Maybe That's I really cool. care about And maybe I because of my You're healthiness. Lucky. I don't know. You're yeah. lucky. Yeah. You had a, you had a privilege. Privilege? Privileges. Privileges. You have yeah. privilege. <laughs> or you yeah. have a privileged girl. Yeah, maybe I am. But I, as Kalena said, I gotta wait until we become 40. <laughs> no yet. <laughs> and everybody's laughing. Yes, I'm not. I'm not curving, but I'm really older than you. <laughs> I almost, let me check. You're 30, 23, right? I am. But uh -huh. don't look like that. Ah, you're going to be my BFF forever and never, you know? <laughs> Actually, you look my, like my sister. Oh, really? Ah, you're, you're my brother. Hey, that's nice. Hey, how old is she, by the way? <laughs> <laughs> She's my twin. I don't know how to say that. Your twin? Your twin, really? Uh, I, how, is, how you can say that twin, but you no. Know, different. Yeah. Hamelos. Yes, but mellizos is when it, one is a girl and the other one is a boy. Oh, I, I didn't know that. Oh, that's good. You see, I learned something new every day. Oh, really? So she's 23 as well. Yeah. Oh, it might look like 23. That would be nice. No. no. <laughs> I wish, but not anymore. <laughs> Why not? You only came. Yeah, you only have to believe it. Well, that's true. But the problem is that I feel it already. You know. <laughs> yeah. Just feeling but, your bonds. Yes, exactly. You're right. <laughs> you're right. Well, leave it like thirties, okay? I'm, I'll be pleased if you said I'm like thirties. I'm. I'm. A, I'm nice. I'm. I'm happy about that. Okay. <laughs> so leave it like thirties. That would be nice. <laughs> hey guys so tell me something are you ready and happy because this is the last day of our curse no Carito, why you said no i don't like the bye bye you don't like the bye bye oh imagine me that I have to say bye bye to you every time, and I don't know if I'm gonna be with you again, or if I'm gonna be with a new group. Oh, can you imagine me? It's very, really hard for a teacher to say bye bye. It is short the time. Only but you would, uh, will you will be our teacher in the next modules or not? To be honest with you, Mr. Cavagero, um, I do not have any idea about it. I don't know. It depends. 
It depends what they said. I don't know. I wish, but it will depend. I okay, wish. I, understand. I hope so. And I hope so. Me too. <laughs> but that, it depends on what they're going to say. So if I say, you continue with these guys, they're crazy guys, and you too. So no, I'm just kidding. Oh. <laughs> and I realize, like, yeah. Or they said, no, they will be with somebody else. Hey, you will learn. Uh, if you're with somebody else, you will learn a lot. All the teachers are really nice. They're really, really nice. My coworkers are really good ones. They're not as crazy as I am, but they're nice. <laughs> and Irina said, no way. <laughs> no, you're not crazy, teacher. You're really? a very nice person. Thank you. I'm trying to be, to be like calm with you because I am crazy. I have a lot of energy that you cannot imagine. I think more than Kirby, and I'm older than him. That's true, because you transmit your energy uh, to us, because uh, yeah, everyone, we are tired. And, and <laughs> exactly. You, you did the, the class. Uh, I, I feel very short, the class. Really? Oh, that's yeah. nice to hear. That's the purpose of that. But, but because you, are, uh, you have a lot of energy, an incredible energy. Thanks yeah. for that. No, thank you. Well, and I'm trying to because to be honest with you, I'm not dunk anymore, right, Kirby? Yes, I have to be honest, I'm not dunk. But uh, you know, I don't know, maybe because I that's the way I am. You cannot imagine <laughs> how energy I have. Yes, and I have to calm down at some times. <laughs> yeah, my mama said, Oh, your horse is a girl, hold your horse. Yeah. Imagine when I was a little girl, like 14s or 18s. Can you imagine? Four of my parents, right? <laughs> no, I'm the youngest one, you know? I'm the youngest one. I have Honestly, uh, four six. Of them, teacher. Four Honestly, of them, yes. Four of I know. Them, yeah. You know, yes. When I was a little baby girl, where my my father had a job that basically he has to travel all around the world. So he was outside of the house most of the time. But um, I don't know, when, when something happens to me, all the time he was here at home. For example, I was like, so one day I was jumping, coming down from the stairs of my house and I had it in my mouth, like a bottom, a bottom, yeah? And I don't know what happened that I opened my mouth and I swallowed it, like, Whoa. and I was like, <laughs> yeah. And my father had to turn, turn it on to me and like push it on, my, on the back of my feet like this, and like a came out. That is one time. Hey. Yes, that is one time. I don't know the second time. I was supposed to go to like art classes, but I didn't want to go that day. And you know what? The kids would love to like run, run, round and round and come in faster from down the stairs like this. And my mama said, watch out, you're gonna fall down, watch out. And you know what? Always when parents said something, that became true, right? So what happened? I fall down. I fall down and I had a, like a big hole like this on the bottom of my leg, no, from the, in front of my leg. So basically my mom, well, that day I didn't, I didn't go to classes because of all my accident. Well, that is another thing. And that was another, another time as well, I remember. We were like eight people and we have a huge, a huge dining room, a huge ones. And all the chairs were like, like this form. They were like, uh, the chairs were like a wood material. Then there was a space okay. that, that a little baby girl can like play, like going back and forward, back and forward, back and forward from the whole, from the whole, over the design of the chair, right? So it was like this, like this, woo -hoo like this but when suddenly something happens and I was like going in front but I couldn't like return I was like uh, 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 oh my god I cannot get out of from here I was like this uh, uh. can you imagine so my head is stuck in a place of the chair so I was like uh oh and I gotta start uh words about that and worry about that but my father came and he did this click and he helped me. Yes. So that was, and then I have many stories that you cannot imagine. You were trapped by the chair. I was trapped by the chair. I was, 
I think I was five years old by then. I think so. Ooh. You was your angel guardian in, in life. <laughs> yeah, I think so. My father. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and I, I, there's another thing that I remember. Um, my father loved the uh, the roof, the rocks. You know, rocks like rug is like the um, alfombra rug. Yeah. And uh, one time, my older sister was using like uh, what? Well, how you say that in Spanish? Oh, aguja capotera, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, Is that in English? No. <laughs> you need to figure it out how to say that in English. Come on. Hey, somebody was supposed to search for something, right? Neil. Just to say Neil. No, I, I don't know how to say capotera. Just Neil. I, no, a big, big Neil. It's because. Uh, yeah, because the, the that one is, is a huge nil, right? It's a big one. It's not the smaller one, okay. it's a big one. So uh, my sister lost it on the rug. And she said, oh my God, I cannot find that. So can you please help me? And I was doing like this. Okay, I will try to help you, we'll try to help you. And I was touching all the rug. And I said, no, no, why? I couldn't find it, so I'm sorry. And then when I put my hand like this, oops, I found it. It was here. It was here. I crossed my hand. You know what? I found it. So yeah, I was stuck in my in my hand. Can you imagine? So well, and I have more stories to tell you, but oh, I'm yeah. I will need more than an hour. <laughs> so yes, you're right, Irina. I was really managed girl. <laughs> And I was the youngest one. I'm the youngest one, you know? I'm the youngest one. And your sister, it looked like you or it was very patient? And, no, she was the opposite of me. She was my um, oldest sister. We were like five girls and one boy. So she was the oldest one of the girls. Let me check. So she's... The I, I'm, I'm the baby, actually. No, you, you, you're not the baby. You're the air queen. Uh, yes, I am. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. And I am the baby as well. Come on. Yeah. And you said, teacher, <laughs> probably <laughs> I am the hair <laughs> queen. Yes, probably. Yeah. No, you know what? Each of us has a different personalities. But um, I think I'm the most um, terrible one. Yes. Talking about energy, of course, right? That's how we used. What? That, that's how we used to call one of our. That was uh, how we used to call one of our cousins. An ah, earthquake. earthquake. They used to. Yeah, because they used to uh, break everything, toys. Ooh, okay. Uh, hassle everything. <laughs> everything. Anything they they found, they can break. Oh my God. Wow. Uh, yes, because you know what? My brother was really nice. He was the only boy. Uh, but he was like, let me check. He was always patient and calm. And he's really, really brilliant. He's really intelligent. He's really smart. So he was like, he's not that, that regular kind of guy, right? No, he's not. Mm -mm. He's really, really calm. And uh, now he's, he's 50 years old right now. Mm -hmm. He's still young. Yeah, he's still young, of course. Paquito, you're right about that. <laughs> yes. Yes. I'm in the fifty, and I'm. You still see, young. you're in the fifty, and you feel like with a young spirit, right? So that's right. What what Kirvin said. If you feel it, that's good, right? That's the that's the added to my man. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Fifty. You're fifty. Paquito, no. I said 15. Oh, I apologize. Oh, you see, I'm getting older because to be honest with you, sometimes I'm like, like I'm dead, right? <laughs> All right. And I, I heard you said 15. I was like, no way. Uh, but you are on your 15s. Okay, good. Yeah, that's the spirit, my man. Of course, that's the spirit. <laughs> <laughs> what happened see from my life uh, uh, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> of course of course <laughs> and hernandez is like they're crazy yes we are 
be be the 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 baby of the family is amazing because I yes. am the youngest. Um, and I have child here, but they're my nephew. My nephew. Uh huh. But my mo my father and my mother still treat me like a baby me. So you, you will always be. You will always be. Yeah. And also how uh older brothers is amazing. I, I got a story because I used to work with with my brothers mm -hmm. and I remember that our job was a little bit heavy because we have to load and unload so many trucks. Mm -hmm. And when I was tired, my, my brother always told me, Hey, are you tired? I mean, yeah, you know, let's let's there and and sit and sit and sit down there. I'm gonna do it for you. You I mean like oh <laughs> Aww. they always treat you like that, right? Yeah, yeah. I know. <laughs> and you always be their baby, okay? That's for sure. That's for sure. I have that. <laughs> yes, yes. You I it, well, I'm still my mom's baby and already married. Can you imagine? Yes. So she always treats me like that. She's just still alive. My father, no, but my mother, yes. And every time that I came and visit her, she always have something for me. <laughs> and of course, for my pets. Mm-hmm, yeah. For whiskey and for chestnuts. I don't know what, what happened with them. What? Where does your mother live? Here in El Salvador. <laughs> oh, I thought she was in... in, in... UK because I, I heard that you were uh, living in the UK. Uh, me? Living in the UK? No way. No. <laughs> you said that, that you, you grew up in the in the UK. That's what you said at the beginning <gasps> of the first. No, I didn't say that. Oh, you didn't say that? No. She said oh. that she learned English with people from the UK. But, exactly. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I saw the same thing. I, I think you you were live in the UK. <laughs> no, 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 no. I wish, but oh, now miss you miss that. I miss something. <laughs> you and me, Paquito. <laughs> it was not, it was not only you, Paquito. It was not only you. Also, Cabrera, so high five, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I like to apologize. No, that's okay. Don't worry. What what Carito said is true. I learned with them, so I learned grammar with them a lot. That that's why I know I love grammar, and that's why I love grammar. And that's why your accent. That's what my accent exactly. Everybody said, uh, 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 "You want to feel fancy? No, is that's the way they speak." Mm -hmm. and, and what can I do? Nothing. I remember that one of my teachers said, okay, you have really good grammar, but you have Syrian geography. Because I remember that I didn't understand one sentence. I, know, I, I don't remember exactly what's, what was the topic that we were double checking by then. But what I wrote is that was the Nile River was in Spain. Can you imagine? Wow. <laughs> yes, and, and it's not, right? So she said, oh my God, you have really great, um, uh, grammar, but you have Syrian geography, she said, and I was like, Ooh. now I feel okay. Yes, now you feel okay. <laughs> yeah, and it was an old lady. Uh, it was an old lady with a blue eyes. She had, she was wearing glasses. And she was like, like this. I need an, an example, two examples, please. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> okay. So you cannot imagine. I'm a really nice teacher with grammar. She was I like, hmm. in Spain. Hmm? Imagine Nile River in Spain. Can you imagine? No, that was not. Pro okay, can you imagine? I believe, I believe she say Morocco, something like that. You know. Plus, no. But not in Spain. I know. I was like, let me check how how old I was. Uh, I was ten or eleven years old by then. And I was like, mm, sorry, teacher. Hmm. She was like, hmm, you bet. I cannot. Believe. All right, but since then I learned that, of course, Nile River is not in Spain. I learned that from sure. Okay, that's common in that age. Of course, of course, I was a little baby. You see, I made a grammar mistake. Feel, uh -huh. You don't have to feel bad for that. <laughs> but but I did. 
I really, I really feel bad because I thought that you were living in the UK. Nah, really feel don't feel bad about it. That's okay. That would be nice. No, my, uh, who said that? My cousin lives in Sweden. Oh, wow. He's a chef. Mm -hmm. mm. He's a chef. He's a really it's good chef. The, it's Switzerland, the, uh, the, uh, the smallest uh, country in Europe? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. He lives Thank there. You. You're welcome. I, 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 was, I wasn't sure. I but now you're sure, sure. <laughs> and there he's he's learning uh well he already speaks english he's learning a little bit of more french in sweden as well because they need to speak sweden wow. so, and he's john i think he's like 27 years old oh, pretty young pretty young yes hey guys today we will continue with another grammar theme hey i didn't play any audio yesterday you My, did it. I did it, right? Okay. So this is what I want you to do. Uh, I just want you guys to listen about something and you just let me know what exactly had happened. That's all that I need. Okay. So put your 100% concentration and then we're going to talk about that. So let me just a couple of minutes. Amilcar, I love your picture. You look nice. Thank you. <laughs> I, I already know that, he said. Mm-hmm. I looked fresh there. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. Oh, my goodness. You know what? Something happens to you after oh. the training, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. I think that I have to get a little vacation. <laughs> I think so. Yeah. By the way, this Sunday, I, I had an invitation <laughs> for the beach. It's going to be impossible to go. All right. Ash. I'm going to go later. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So please listen carefully and you're going to tell me exactly what had happened in this um, situation. All right. So just bear with me. Let me share right now my screen with you. There you go. Okay. Part A. Listen and practice. Guess what? Someone stole my wallet last night. Oh, no. What happened? Well, I was working out, and I had put my stuff in my locker, just like I always do. When I came back, someone had stolen my wallet. I guess I'd forgotten to lock the locker. That's terrible. Did you lose much money? Only about $15, but I lost my credit card and my driver's license. What a pain. Okay. One more time. Are you okay? Yep. He forgot. He forgot to lock his lock. lock he, right. he forgot to uh, to lock his locker exactly. Lock and, locker. and so, what had happened to him? Uh, someone so stole had stolen his wallet. wallet. Someone had stolen the wallet. And, oh my God! It, it, did he have like a lot a lot of money on the wallet or not? Just, Just how much money? Dollars. He had. $15. But he his lost credit the credit, his credit card mm. and the license. Exactly, and the driving license. Oh my God, <laughs> what a terrible situation, right? That had happened to you sometimes like that? No? Mm. No? no? Of course, not in the locker, but in another place. I don't know. <laughs> uh, it happened once. A long time happened ago. Uh huh. Time ago, when I was young. Are you still uh, young? Younger. I live I, in a best safe country in the world. So uh, of course. Happened. Okay. It is. It is. <laughs> continue. <She said> it. <laughs> Con continue, Irina. Go ahead. I I uh, took the bus at, uh, at the CCS Centro Cultural Salvadoreño. All right. Yes, uh, of course. The uh, 16, 16 room. Uh huh. And uh, went to Escalon. Okay. And I I go in the bus and I uh, I ride to my office and start start to work. And about ten in mm -hmm. the morning, uh, somebody called me mm -hmm. and and tell me you are uh, are Arina you Hernandez? Yes. Mm -hmm. And I say yes. Uh, I have your documents. 
my documents, no, my documents I have on my bag. No, look, and I was, uh, and I looked for my documents and I didn't have it. Oh my goodness, but you know what? Thanks God that you receive a, a call from an honest person. Yes. yes, but I lost money. I lost about 700 uh, colones. Oh, but over at that time, it, were money. Yeah. it was money. Because, yeah. That was uh, a lot of money. Yeah. Um, a, co a cousin of mine gave me this money to pay something. Oh, it no. It took, took from my back, but I just uh, have my documents. And they were uh, throwing at the Boulevard de los Héroes. Uh -huh. uh, the, the, the man who gave me found over there. Wow. Yeah. Oof. I'm so sorry about that because you had to like pay the, uh, your yeah. cousin back, right? And it was I not just by yes. all honest, right? Yeah. Wow. But at least you got the documents. We are, they're yes. really like, not, not, we cannot say like this, like um, it's hard when you lose them because of the money, no, because of the time yes. that you need to spend to recover them back. Yeah, all the tramits and everything. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, wow. Yeah. I'm sorry to hear that. So you <laughs> see, we had passed to that situation. But guys, did you identify what type of expression they use when they talk about what had happened? And especially this guy. Do you, do you remember which, which uh, past phrases? Perfect. Past perfect, exactly. And he used something else, right? He used past simple as well and past continuous as well. So guys, this is really important because remember that right so far we have learned two uh, past tenses, right? We have learned past continuous and simple past. And we have learned to use both of them to, for example, when we were talking about an action that has already been started in the, in the past and mm -hmm. another action interrupts the in the past, right? Uh-huh. But now, past continuous, we're using it in a different way. We use the past continuous uh, still, of course, when we're talking about two actions in the past. But what we use it is that, for example, a, when, the past con when the past perfect appears, another action has occurred before that. Let me give you an example. Could you repeat that, please? Yes, Irina. Yes, Irina. Yeah, for example, we use the past perfect in this case for an event, guys, that occurred before another event in the past. For example, he said something, right? When I came back, you see? When I came back, simple past, someone had stolen my wallet, right? So what happened in this case? What was the action that had happened? Somebody had stolen that, the, the, the wallet, right? That was the action that happened before another action in the past. What was the other action? That he came back. You see? So there were two actions. That the past perfect was used to explain, of course, an event in the past but there the was another event occurred before that action. Let me give you another example. I think it's going to be a little bit easier for you. Um, I can say, I went to a party last Saturday, but when I got, when I got there, a, my friends had eaten all the pizza. You see? That was something that occurred in the past, the party that you went on Saturday. But also, when you arrived there physically, another action had happened before. What was the other action? That your friends had eaten all the pizza and there was not even a slide of pizza for you. Can you imagine? So they're not good friends, right? Mm -hmm. You are starving and they're full, come on. Okay, so can you, so you see how we use it? So you see how we use it? It's really easy. It's not complicated. But I just want you to know, guys, how it's you use it. Yeah, like a piece of cake. You know that, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, so. I like that phrase. You like that phrase? 
yeah I, I, I just i give you guys a, a, a simple examples because i want you guys to identify how you use it i know that in spanish we have only one pass or at least two passes right and that's all but in english no in english we have past continuous simple pass past perfect etc right so you need to learn how to use it and when to use it. Let me give you an example. Another example I can say. Um, you can say, remember one phrase that the uh, guy used? He said, I was working out, right? Maybe he was working out on a gym. That could be the reason. And I had put my stuff in my locker. That's what he said, right? I was working out. That what kind of bird tends that? Is a simple past or past continuous? Past continuous. Past continuous. So that means another action is the past. I was working out and I had put, I had put my stuff in the locker. You see, I had put. That is past perfect. Remember, guys, the past perfect we use the, the auxiliary have. Remember that in the past, which is in this case is had, right? for any any kind of uh, pronouns they use for he, she, it, we, you, they. You know that, right? And the past participle of the verse, remember? So you gotta uh, remember what is the past participle of the verse, irregular ones and the regular ones. Okay? You're supposed to know that. So what I said, I was working out when I was working out and then I had put and I, oh, I had left my stuff in the locker. So you see? Before you work out, you have done another action prior. What was the action? You had put your stuff, your wallet on the locker. Is it easy peasy quizzy? Yes, of course, right? That's, that's what happened. He put on, not in the locker. On the locker. Should, on the locker or in the locker? What you said? He should put in the locker. Uh-huh. Yes, exactly. Because it is inside, why, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Exactly. He, uh, he got lost. Uh, his, uh, he put stuff. it in. No, <laughs> he put it in, but, but he forgot to lock. To exactly. Lock. He put it in. That means like physically the wallet was inside the locker, but oops, he was, he maybe it. he was running out of time and he forgot to lock that, right? That's why somebody else came and had stolen the wallet. Mm-hmm. Hey, now let me double check if you understood. Can I have an example, Paquito? Oh, I, arrived, I arrived to my parents' house. Uh huh. Because they were planning a trip, but when, when, but when I arrived, they had gone. Okay, very good. Very good. When I arrived, they had gone. Exactly. That means that they had gone before you arrived. Very good. Excellent job. A another example, uh, Irina. Yay. Sí. Um, I was um, arriving at home mm -hmm. when my little cat uh, jumped. Have jumped. Have jumped mm -hmm. on the roof. <gasps> really? Oh. Yeah. That's a little interesting cat. <laughs> and what's the name of your cat? It's Cristela. Cristela. Oh, that's a, that's a girl? Yes. Oh, oh I, I lost my one. Really? Yeah. So like a one week ago, she never came back. I don't know where she is. Oh, somebody maybe... Uh, has stolen it. So stolen has stolen it, right? Has stolen it. Um, yeah. I'm so sorry. Um, my cat, I rescued... You rescued her? You rescued her? Yeah, rescued her. Uh, tomorrow is going to be one year oh. that I rescued because uh, she always was walking on the on the roof, mm -hmm. and and I and I told her, "Come on, come on! I'm going to give you something to eat." And mm. she just to look me and and oh. went. Oh. And finally, I convinced her. Oh, that had happens to me, but she was six months. She was still a baby. So oh, hopefully yeah. somebody has uh, had, um, um, I don't know, take uh, take care of her. I don't know. Yeah, hopefully. Maybe. Maybe yeah. somebody stole. Yeah. But hopefully she's fine. Yeah. Hope, yeah. Hope, 
I hope so too. Thank you, Rina. Let me double check who else. Uh -uh. Alex, what about you? Can I have an example, please? Ah. 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 <laughs> oh, uh, um, for example, um, I, I went out. Um, Mm -hmm. and I was I went out from my house in a rush, right? Mm -hmm. uh, and I I I thought I I left the the the, the TV the TV on. Mm -hmm. I came back, and my wife was your wife. Uh, it turned. Your wife had what? Had turned. Uh, Turn, turn it off. Already. Turn it off already. Yeah. Very good. Excellent. Remember that with present perfect or past perfect, we use already, right? Remember that is those are the uh the workies. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Oh my god, okay. he likes to complicate his cell, right? He was the whole support brand. I was like, okay, <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's good. Excellent. Very good job. Okay, you know, I, I was uh huh. I was uh I was writing a point, but someone has already had already read, written uh -huh. hey, very good that's excellent uh -huh. carito can i have an example please okay it could be the alarm of the office sounds and when i return my boss had already turned it off very good excellent that's a good one <laughs> A milker. What about you, sir? <laughs> okay. Um, I had applied in a lot of places, but I never received a call. Okay. Oh, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> that's good. Okay. Excellent. Let me check, Mr. Kirby Ramirez. What about you? Okay. Um... Oh, okay, go ahead. <laughs> okay, the time uh, the time that I was born, my mom uh, had already finished her studies. Her high school? Her high school, yeah, her oh. studies, I don't know. Oh, so when I was born, my mother had already finished her high school or her studies, basically. Yeah. Oh, that's good. That's really nice example. Very good. Oh, so your mama had you pretty young age. Well, that's good. Uh, 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 no, not at all. Not at all. Uh, no, no, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Hernandez, what about you? What do you have for us? Mr. Hernandez. Hello. Hello, Mr. Hernandez. How are you? I'm here. I, I'm just thinking. Uh, uh, You're I thinking. Ah, oh, that's no, why I'm it smells like her. something burning. Uh huh. Oh, uh, here. Sorry. <laughs> Wait a minute, please. Okay. Yes, of course. Wait, he said. When my brother came home, hey, okay, I had done homework. I'm sorry. Ah, okay. I'm sorry, but you lost your turn. So Luisito oh, really? was speaking. So don't worry. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Leave it like that way. But we're going to listen, to Luisito, once again. Okay, Luisito. Can you please repeat your idea? When my brother came home, I had already done my homework. Excellent job. Oh, very good. That was really nice. Very good, sir. Now let's listen to Mr. Hernandez. Unfortunately, that's not true. I haven't worked in the platform. But you invented, which is really good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, Mr. Hernandez, there you go. Sorry, which tenses are you using? Ah, uh, no. I just got, no. I just got lost. I killed because, him. Uh, hey, guys, kill him, please, for me. Yeah. Ah, well, uh, 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 man. Present perfect and simple past, right? No, past perfect. Ah, past perfect. Uh huh. In uh, hey, guys, and explain to Mr. Hernandez, please. Somebody uh, will be my right hand today. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. There's no excuse. Uh -huh. Okay. When do we use the past perfect, guys? When do we use it? Yeah. When something already happened in the past. Exactly. When another, basically, when another action in the in the or event past 
in the past, of course, right? Can I have an example, please, Carito? So Mr. Hernandez can figure it out as well. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm going to say one. This. An another one. <laughs> another one. Another one. No, 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 no. no. Okay. Come on. Um, I don't know. Yes, you know. Let me think. Oh, my goodness. Another <laughs> brain that is going to burn. <laughs> um, uh, when I came to my home for mm -hmm. work, mm -hmm. well, my when I came back mom home. had, okay, when I came, came, excuse me, back home, uh, my mom had already made the dinner. Okay, that's good, excellent. Okay, Mr. Hernandez. Okay, I got it. Yeah, uh, very good. I was eating pizza and I went to, for a glass of water. Mm -hmm. And when I came back, my slice of pizza had already gone. <laughs> who who had eaten the cat? I don't I don't know. <laughs> oh, my dog, I think not. Your dog? Maybe yeah. because I don't know about your dog. My my dog is they love pizza by heart. Really? <laughs> yeah. I think they they or could they, they yeah, they could eat like a whore. They could they could eat a horse. Oh. That means they are todo uh, terreno. They are good at a horse. Uh, yeah. Yeah, exactly. So they are like that way. I don't know about you, but in my case, yes. So I'm sorry for that. Sergio, can you listen to us? I don't know what happened to Sergio's internet, but sometimes I know that he's there, but I think he has like um, a hard connection that is really hard for, for him to like speak. I don't know what's going on, but, but at least he's here. So it was good. There you go. Okay, guys. So you see that it's really easy peasy queasy, right? It's not complicated. Yeah, ah, Galena, I was missing you. Ah, no, 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 She's, she was really quiet. Like the teacher, she will forget Don't about me. Don't worry, it's okay. <laughs> no, I do <laughs> worry. Come on, you were like, hey, don't say anything, please. Oh, no way. I was waiting, like maybe she said, teacher, you're missing me, but no. <laughs> okay, uh -huh. Kalena, let's listen to you. Okay, I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> you do your best. Um, uh -huh. Last night, um, last night at 7 p.m., uh -huh. I was having dinner. Uh -huh. When the uh, phone, no. Mm -hmm. When my sister came asking for a favor, Ah, kind of, but the second no. action supposed to be past perfect. Ask for a favor. Uh-uh. No. Yeah. When, when my sister called. Called or had? The, because remember had. that, remember that the, that uh, the first action was right. But the second uh -huh. action supposed to be like past perfect. Okay, okay, okay. Uh -huh. But last night at seven uh, uh, p.m., I was having dinner uh -huh. when my cell phone ran. Had the run. Had the run, and was my sister. Oh, had asked for a favor. No, neither. Mm -hmm. no. No, for example, remember that what happened is that when you do something, uh -huh. but, but before you, you do that action, there was another action that occurred before. For example, um, they had, oh, you can say, my sister had called me Mm -hmm. asking uh -huh. for a favor ask you for a favor before i came back home for example you see okay. two two actions that uh that were in the past but the first action the past perfect occur before the second action ah oh, okay Like, like Carito said, uh, yesterday I came back home mm -hmm. and my mother had 
already prepared the dinner. Or she said, my mom had already prepared the dinner before, before I, I came, came back home. home. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So you see okay. what happened first? That her mama prepared a dinner mm -hmm. before she came. You see? There were two okay. actions in the past. I think I can understand that. Yeah, do I... your best. <laughs> Don't help her, guys. Don't help her. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we... I, I mean, still with, with the, same, the same idea, but... but I... That's okay. Uh, okay, last night we we were having dinner. Mm -hmm. When I when when I realized that I had a phone call from my sister. Ah, okay, okay, I got, I got your point. Okay. So you were having dinner, but you didn't have time to check your cell phone. Yes, and, right? and the, 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 the call, it was ah. in my cell phone. And when you, for example, figure, when you went to check your cell phone, mm -hmm. you, I realized you, know, you realized that I had the, the, the call. That your sister had called you, uh -huh. right? Very yes. good, excellent. Okay, okay. Very I good. Tried. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but it was okay. nice. Very good okay. job. Woohoo! You see, mm -hmm. but but okay. to complicate your life, guys, is easy. Try to make like a simple sentences. <laughs> but I know I got your. But you understand, right? You see. Yes. So, so what happened? So. I think. So what happened before you're having dinner with your family is that your sister called you. you yes. See? So that action yes. had a cure before that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you see mm -hmm. how we use past continuous, guys? Past continuous. Past perfect. Sorry. Uh huh. Yes. Yeah. Right. You see, it, it is kind of different. It's, there's like a slightly difference, right? But I want you guys to understand when do you use it? When you, when you understand how to use it, you will be able to speak and to uh, properly, like a native one, okay? Say, so guys, what I'm gonna do, I will try to figure it out and find out because I have um, an image that explain it to you, all the verb tenses, uh, the formulas, and examples, right? So you can like compare ah this and this and this and this and this. And this. So you could you will have like a better idea about the verb tenses. So what? But I have to like search for that on my X files, right? <laughs> on my X files, yeah. you know what? My expedience is correct as X. My X files, right? <laughs> so right. I'm gonna figure it out, and and I will try to search for them, and I will try to send it to you, okay? I will okay. do it my best. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, because that is really that is really helpful. Yeah, I have it here. I I dream about grammar every single day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's different. It's different. Of it's um, Spanish grammar and English grammar is different. Sometimes they're kind of similar, but not all the time. So that depends. But let me ask you guys, if you understand in Spanish grammar, sometimes it will be easier for you because you can compare. But, but that depends. And let's say, I know, teacher, no way. I remember when I, were, when I was a little girl and I was passing through that subject, but no anymore. Hey, guys, let me ask you something. Um, I'm going to give you, it's not going to be a next, uh, homework because, of course, we're not going to see each other, right? <laughs> uh, well, I don't know when, right? But today is the finish time. So basically, when I'm going to send it to you, something that you will be able to practice, okay? That you will be able to practice. So it will be like, take it for practice for yourself. I'm going to send it to you. So let me just a couple of minutes. Let me share it with you. And basically, guys, it will be uh, two sections. Uh, one is for, um, let me check. One is for simple past. Uh -huh. And other one is for past perfect. So let me double check really quickly. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Somebody happens that, uh, I think somebody uh, left because uh, she, she ran out of energy, ran out of energy. So let me double check really quickly. 
tell me guys as soon as you receive it, please, okay? Well, let me just a couple of minutes. No, this is not good. All right, okay, there you go. Oh my God, no way. Sometimes this one doesn't want to work, you know? I don't know why. All right, there you go. Okay. Okay, I got it. Okay. Okay, guys, hopefully you will receive it. And if not, you let me know, okay, if you do not receive it. Did you guys receive it or no yet? No yet. No yet, right. All right. Okay, I sent it to you already. There you go. Now, what Thank about you. now? Yeah, all yes. right. Oh, guys, you know what? Uh, uh, time passed really fast. I'm sober. Yes, it's, it's over. It's already nine. Oh my yeah. goodness. Wow, time passed really fast. I haven't noticed that. Eww. When you get fun, the time is. Yes, over. exactly. That's true. That's true. Oh my God. Well, guys, uh, this was the last class of our model. All right. Hopefully, you have enjoyed a little bit. Hopefully, you have learned a little bit, right? Um, and I don't know if we, we will continue with each other. Hopefully, yes, but it that will depends. So please, guys, if you haven't finished the platform, please do it. You have until today at midnight to finish it. So please do it. If you have done, that's okay. I think most of you have done it. So I'm really glad and happy because you finished it. And yeah. uh, well, guys, I have learned a lot from you, especially Spanish words. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I there those are brand new for me. Yes. Thank you, teacher. Yeah, thank you. Especially the Ginda. So I know, but it was not you, it was the other group. Mm -hmm. she, she said Ginda, and I was like, Ginda was ah I thought it was the fruit because I know there's a fruit, right? A yes. citrus yeah. fruit. But yeah. she said Ginda is like ah, like a runaway, <laughs> like it's Piri Gonzalez. Ah, there you go. Okay, now I learned Ginda. Ah. <laughs> yeah, she, it, it, so I and know you, that, right? Uh -huh. And you know what is a Ginda, teacher? I know, it's a little fruit. No, Gindo, come with O. I don't know, what's that? Uh, in uh, the Honduras, uh -huh. the people call Gindo al uh, Barranco. Really? Yeah. Oh my goodness. They say, I'm going to throw away on, on a guindo. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so you see why, guys, it's really complicated for a foreigner to learn Spanish? Yes. yes. Because, for example, Latin American people, we have our own words. Yes. For And sometimes, for example, in El Salvador, when you would like to talk about a thing, you have to learn what is boladito, chunche, Cuenterete. Yes. And I was like, oh my God. And you're yes, using for this just one little thing. And can you imagine El Salvador? Now, if you go to another place, it's like, no. It is really hard for somebody like he's out of El Salvador or an European or even American guys to learn Spanish because Spanish is really complicated, especially for the regions modelisms, right? Mm. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Can you imagine Ginda? And now I learned Gindo. <laughs> I didn't know that it was a masculine word for Ginda. But now I learned that Gindo it is a whole, right? Yes. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, I learned a new, a new word for me. So that's good. Okay, guys. I wish you the best. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Please continue Thank reading, you. do your best, and hopefully we can see each other later. And if not, well, you will learn something new for that other teacher. I guarantee it. Okay? Thank you very much. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye.